Well, Wookie's looking a little bit scruffy, and that's because I've actually been away for a bit over a month, and she's been staying with family at, at our home. So she's she's been well, but we haven't been around to to groom her, and as well, she's a little bit chubby because she's been fed a different food that's quite fatty. But all in all, she's looking pretty good for not being groomed for so long. So today I'm going to start by using the dematting mm -hmm. comb to just cut through any small knots in a coat. I don't think there's any point in giving her a wash yet before I do that. Mm -hmm. So so I'm just going to use this dematting comb. It's just an easy way to break up the, the knots in the coat without needing to cut out large areas of hair or to shave her. So it's a great little tool. So after this, I will give her mm -hmm. a wash and get her back to looking all nice and fluffy. So I was quite worried about leaving Wookie for a full month. It's the longest I've ever been away from her. She, I think we've gone away for maybe two weeks before at the most. Uh, this time she handled it fairly well. Um, the family that was looking after her said she was crying for two days straight when we left, which was a bit hard to hear. But after that, she settled down and, and just waited at the window for us to come home. So you, it's always a worry about how anxious she would be and if she'd be too upset. But she seems to have handled it fairly well. It's not something that I'd really want to do to her again, but we just had to go away for a while. And now that we're back, she's quite happy. She seems to be settling down a bit. She's a tiny bit clingy, but she seems to be just enjoying the fact that we're here. She gets quite excited now in the morning when we wake up and she runs around the house for a while and runs around outside all, all happy and is quite keen to play more than what she normally would be. So she seems to have you know, handled us being away for that one month period quite well. And now since we've come back I've been making sure I've taken her out a lot and, and if she wants a cuddle or wants attention on, I'm making sure I give it to her so she's you know, a little bit happy and gets to catch up on all that missed time together. I actually expected her hair to be more knotted than it is, but I guess that's because I normally take her on at least one walk a day, normally. And while I've been away, she has gone out for some walks, but not quite as many, so she hasn't picked up as much dirt and just that sort of tends to the more active she is the, the more her hair will get tangled and knotted and pick up little sticks or just dirt that sort of causes her to get itchy and then she scratches and you know, kind of makes the coat get a little bit matted quicker. And after a quick wash, you can see she's all nice and fluffy and looks good again. So the way I get her all fluffy is by combing her and blow drying her hair after she's been washed. Normally when I, I wash her, I also use a comb. When she's got all soap suds in her hair, I, I give her a good comb. And it breaks up you know, remaining knots and makes it much easier to fluff her up once we go to dryer. So I just use a standard hair dryer set on the coldest setting um, and I just don't stay in the one place for long at all. I move around quite a bit and I always use a comb at the same time and I comb against the way the hair naturally lays so it sort of brings up and fluffs up the hair quite a bit. And so now she's looking all fluffy and back to her normal self, except for the, the pudgy stomach. <laughs>